Hello, today I want to talk uh, about range premium tier 8 light tank ELC even 90 uh, about crew equipment and field modifications. To cover up some basics, this tank is very small, uh, has outstanding concealment values and autoloader for three shells with uh, two and a half seconds uh, between shots. Penetration on standard shell is uh, 175 and uh, 215 with uh, premium shells. 90 millimeter gun, which is pretty uh, decent on this tank. Uh, dispersion is not so great, aiming time is not so great, by, but taking in account that you are shooting most of the time when you are close to the enemy from the rear or the flanks so it's not a problem for this tank such not so good values uh, complete reload is 30 seconds but it can be up to, uh, up to about 28 seconds but main uh, reason to place this tank is concealment values and we will talk about this a bit later. Uh, one of the advantage uh, of this tank is its size. Uh, its size allows you to take some spots, bushes, which cannot be taken with other tanks. Simply because of the size of this ELC even 90. Uh, and uh, it's very easy tank to play regardless of your skill win rate uh, statistics and so on uh, you simply need to take some nice standard spot and that's all no, nothing else uh, which such uh, with such preconditions you already be uh, good spotter for your team and you will lead your team to victory uh, about the crew you have three crew members and as for skills you definitely need six cents next concealment brother in arms i recommend you to some male crew which will have uh, built in rather in arms or uh, and or six cents and next you will uh, up situational uh, awareness uh, recon to extend your viewing range and next uh, like repair and so on and so on this for commander uh, as for gunner uh, also, rather near arms, concealment, and next uh, designated target, next repair, uh, and then uh, everything else uh, to increase uh, overall effectiveness in a battle. As for driver, uh, as always, rather in arms, concealment, repair, uh, Controlled impact is very nice skill to have because uh, you will be able to run something and receive less damage. And uh, even if some other tanks uh, runs, you you will still be alive. Stabilizations and so on and so on. Nothing out of special, but. Uh, main skills are concealment, brother in arms, and six sense. When you have uh, these three skills, uh, you will uh, be able to be much more efficient than any other light tanks in terms of body. Uh Field modifications. On level 2 you should take valves tuning, which will increase your engine power and decrease forward speed. But uh, you should take in account that uh, 
Overall, the stand do not have uh, outstanding uh, power per ton, uh, and this will greatly help him to be much more mobile on a battlefield. Uh, on level 4, you should take aiming mechanism tuning. This will increase uh, reload time a bit, uh, but will increase your accuracy. Mm, your reload time uh, is pretty long, about 30 seconds. And uh, as a light tank, you're not shooting very much. Uh, so uh, it's much more beneficial to you to um, have a uh, good aim than to have um, smaller reload time and on level 5 uh, you should take lightweight spelling protection this will increase uh, your reverse speed but uh, increase damage uh, from uh, high explosive shells most of the time uh, when you have like stun from an RT uh, crew injury, you simply use medikit and that's all. So you do not care about that. And your best protection uh, from being shot is your concealment. If enemy does not see you, it cannot shot. That, that's all. Uh, and for the uh, second slot, you should uh, take I will explain this uh, a bit later. Um, as for equipment, you you will have two sets of equipment, and uh, first and main set will be aimed exactly on spotting enemy tanks. You must have exactly must have commander's vision system in your main slot. This will allow you to break concealment of other tanks, especially light tanks, much earlier than you should do that normally. Exhaust system, second uh, equipment. Uh, you can use uh, trophy or bounty item. Uh, the this is much more beneficial to you but if you have only like regular equipment this will do also and uh, third optics optics also is a must have uh, second set of equipment is ventilation rotation mechanism and vertical stabilizer. Uh, second uh, set of equipment is aimed for shooting. So uh, on some small maps like Himmelsdorf, Mines, uh, maybe some other setups on some maps and so on and so on, you don't need to spot, but you need to shoot. Like on Himmelsdorf, you you have no like spotting spots there and the map is very small so you simply will be much more effective than, uh, than spotting. As for consumables, uh, like this is one of my favorite farming uh, tanks so uh, I try not to uh, use some expensive equipment and so on. Like small repair kit, uh, small first aid kit, uh, and automatic uh, fire extinguisher. Uh, that's uh, more than enough to be successful in a battle. And with such setup, spotting setup, uh, you will have 52% of concealment while moving and while standing. Uh, this also means that uh, when you standing in some bushes, you will have 100% concealment. You will be, you can be spotted only um, 
when someone is very very close to you or with x-ray uh, that's almost all for this tank uh, i should say um, it will be much more clear uh, i have like uh, 54 percent win rate i played uh, almost uh, six uh, sixty thousand battles and uh, two and a half thousand battles are uh, played on elc even 90. i have a win rate 58 percent average xp uh, 911 and as you can see uh, still i have more than one tank destroyed on average uh, three and a half spotted tanks uh, battle and my assist value is 1700 also a lot of uh, different nice medals uh, on this tank uh, to sum up this is one of the best and easiest tank to play as a light if you can buy it, I recommend you to buy it. Uh, if you don't know how to play light tanks, just be pretty simple. Subscribe to my channel, watch some guides, uh, learn nice spotting spots, and that's all. This will allow you to be very, very successful in in any battle uh, and also don't forget to comment this video and see you next time bye bye